Hello everyone, welcome to Pentacle Math Mania. My name is Captainess123 and today we will be working on rounding off numbers to the nearest hundred using a number line. Rounding numbers to the nearest hundred means finding which hundred the number is nearest to. One way to round numbers to the nearest hundred is by following these steps. Step 1. Underline the hundreds digit. Step 2. Look at the tens digit. Step 3. If that tens digit is less than 5, meaning 4, 3, 2 or 1, then the hundreds digit remains the same and a 0 replaces the tens and the ones. But if the tens digit is 5 or more, meaning 5, 6, 7, 8 or 9, then we add 1 to the hundreds digit and write zeros to replace the tens and the one digits. Let's do an example. Let's round 170 to the nearest hundred. Our hundred digit to underline is one, and our 10 digit to pay attention to is the number seven. Seven is more than five. So we will add one to our hundreds number to make it two, and then we will replace the seven and the eight in the tens and ones column with two zeros. So our answer is 200. So 178 to the nearest hundred is 200. We can also use a number line to round to the nearest hundreds. The number line helps us visually establish which hundred a number is closest to. For example, if we have the number 240, we can see that it's below 250 and it's closest to 200, so we round to 200. Our last example on the number line before we go, let's round 460 to the nearest hundred. We can see that 460 is greater than the halfway mark of 450 and therefore it's closer to 500 on the number line. So we'll round up to 500. So 460 rounded to the nearest 100 is 500. Now you have learned two ways to round to the nearest 100. Whenever you're unsure, just use your number line or follow the steps we looked at. Thank you for visiting Math City today. Try the exercises on penacool.com to earn points and win great prizes.